everybody. Melissa from Buckeye Girls Reason Things. <clears throat> I came live. I thought I'd make a couple things. And see how everybody was doing today. Uh, I don't know why it just told me that I was live. That was weird. But that's okay. Connie told me I needed to go live like this. So I wouldn't have the issue I had yesterday. So I'm going to try it out. Uh, hopefully it works. Hey, hey Susan, how you doing Susan? Hey Faye. What you up to Susan? Doing, doing any uh, Goodwill shopping or going to the Dollar Tree or anything? Good morning, Shauna. I think we need a trip to the Goodwill soon, Susan. You need to do a Goodwill live soon. We ha you haven't took us there for a while. Oh, you like this? Well, yeah. Now you can say now you can say she dresses like me too. She's copying. I have a pink one I'm thinking about sending to you. dovetailing ends of some ribbon and I'm gonna try to I'm trying to do this bow backwards my first bow is gonna be red truck and buffalo plaid and some deer it's gonna be for my wreath yeah you're gonna have to take us it's been a while. I am making some tree toppers. Just something simple. And with tree toppers, you use these because you want it to look like your tree. guys ever I know you guys are in a lot of groups some of y'all are in mine but I joined I had somebody ask me to join this group I ain't naming names and ever since I joined that group it's asked me to okay <clears throat> the approve the members to join the group I'm like what did they I don't know whether they accidentally put me as admin in the group or what but it's been crazy it's a big group and all i do is add members to this group has anybody else had that uh, happen to them going to make about three loops of the deer because you know my whole house is deer I gotta have deer uh, no it's not the Dollar Tree site it's it's uh this this group is called the shabby tree which I really love her design I was thinking about Messenger and say, hey, did you accidentally put me as admin in your group? I mean, I don't care. I'm admin in two groups, my own and Barb's. That's not a big deal, but it's getting to be crazy. As I'm doing my live, I see I have more people to approve to her group.
need both. Uh -uh. Susan, is it getting cold down there? It sure is here. Boy, that wind is just bitter. I think I'm gonna I may end up messing this bow up, but I don't like the way this is turning out. I'm gonna mess it up. I'm gonna use a pipe cleaner and then put this on. I don't like how this is turning out. It's too bulky. Susan knows, but uh, I know a lot of people on this group, on my group, on my page, doesn't know yet. But uh, there is a chance that me and Thad may be moving. We we're not saying where yet, but um, if you see us sell stuff or or uh, do th some things, it's because we're getting ready to move. Uh, we're not quite sure where. But uh, we're planning a move no later than the spring. Yeah, I seen the fireplace. Was really cute. <clears throat> I didn't see the burlap flower. I guess maybe I need to go back and look at it. So, what's everybody working on? Susan, are you working on Christmas yet? I have two tree toppers to do and one other item and I think I'm ready for my craft show. <clears throat> Which I may do two craft shows, I just haven't, haven't I'm, I'm not sure. the burlap flower. Oh, so if I come and I move next to you, to you, Susan, does that mean you're changing my di diaper and, and feed me a bottle? Oh my goodness. Haven't had that done in years. I'll wait till I tell Than. Hey Thad, we 
move next to Susan, she's going to change her diaper and feed us a bottle. be a reason for him not to move next to you, Susan. <laughs> then again, when I married him, his mother cried and says, you're taking my baby. He was 46 years old when I married him. She even gave me his baby teeth. Just what I wanted. Oh, that sounds good. Yes, Creations by Faith Marie is Faith is Pretty. Hey, if you know how to do it, you can drop your link in here. Same way with Susan and whoever else has a page. So we can go over and like on your page. Okay, now I gotta add tails. Well, this one I, I don't wanna add too long of tails because I got a special ribbon treatment I'm doing and showing on my page that I'm doing to my tree. So I don't want to go crazy with the tails. But I'm going to go about, I don't know. That might work. Yeah, the turkey sounds good. Uh, I have, we're debating on whether though we're debating on whether to even do turkey for Thanksgiving. I'm gonna just add these tails. I'm gonna bunch them up and add them right here. And then I'll dovetail the ends. Oh! Pray for you, Kathy. I'll call you later. bought one. That's good. You, you were debating on whether you're getting one when I talked to you last. I don't know what we're having. Uh, Barb from well, my buddy Barb. She she said she normally has baked zeta. I don't know what we're gonna have, but if I did turkey, I'd probably do it ahead of time and and do a video on how I do my turkey. Okay, now I'm gonna put this thing through because I like to attach the this the tree the. the bow to the tree with something that looks like the tree so it doesn't stand out. 
So I'm going to give that a twist and then I'll just attach more to these so it wraps around the top of the tree. And then I'll fluff it if I can find my fluff box. I am making a tree topper bow. Oh, Kathy, they don't have to test me for memory. They know I done lost it. Oh, that's not good. Hey, Tamara. Yeah, this is a tree topper bow that'll go on my Christmas tree whenever I get one. Because I got one and it didn't fit my living room. Hey, Susan, you should have seen that. That was hilarious. You know when you're, when the half the tree, tree limbs was still up against the fireplace and the rest of it filled the entire half of the living room that you know you can't have that tree. It was hilarious. I wish I could send somebody the, this tree because it's a brand new one, but it was tons of glitter. I mean, tons of glitter on it. I'll have glitter on, in my house for the next two years. Be, probably I'll be moved out and I'll, there's people will still be finding gold glitter. I've made quite a few. I have quite a few available in my Etsy shop. And I also have smaller ones in case somebody wants a small have a smaller tree. Oh crap, I made this one too small, but it'll probably work for my tree. The other one I'll have to make it bigger. Since I'm getting a small pencil tree, this one will probably still work. Attach you. Here we go. I think this will be fine on the top of my tree because it's not going to be a very big tree. It's going to be really narrow. But the next one I have to go bigger. Hi Linda. 
Okay, the next one, re remember the hunt I we had for this ribbon. I wanted to do a bow with the red buffalo plaid, the red truck, and the black and white buffalo plaid. And I finally found it. Yeah, um, well, yeah, and my, my tree's got to be really a skinny tree, so, um, I think that'll do fine for me, actually. Yeah, for tree topper bows, I think the pro bow, you can't go wrong there. The easy bow, I, I like them for other things, for some things. But the Probo, I think I still like them for my tree toppers. I seen, uh, but I have seen people do some really pretty easy bow tree toppers. But for me, this is the easiest way. What you doing, buddy? Oscar Meyer. I don't know why, but Oscar has been the clingiest, kissiest thing. Which, if you don't know Oscar, he's our big dash hound. I was talking to Barb the other night on the phone, and all he did is kiss me. I told her, I said, don't tell that about my boyfriend. Which is funny, because he's normally the, our loner. He's the one that likes to stay in the kennel a lot by himself. Because we keep our kennels opened and they can go in there whenever they want. This week, uh, we're going to do a rustic mantle. If you go, so, since I had so many likes on my elf mantle I did last week, I'm doing a rustic mantle this week with, a, with my rustic garland I made and, and a wreath. And I have decided to do less YouTube videos now that I'm feeling a little better and do a more Facebook Live. So you better keep clear your calendar for 2 o'clock because I'll be on more often at 2 o'clock. And I don't know whether I'm frozen or, or there's just no comments. Susan, am I okay, girl? Faith, am I okay? 
Or is this thing frozen? I've had an awful time with my internet lately. I have a couple things I have to make, and I know Susan gonna copy me as soon as I make the one. Yeah. Okay, because I was thinking, I was wondering. I know you two tell me. Yeah, I got a project I, I, I need to make on YouTube or on Facebook Live, one of the two, probably Facebook Live. And I know Susan's going to copy me. I already know it. Barb. Yeah, it's cold here. Oh, wow. I know a lot of people are big football fans. I'm not so much. I guess I better not move to Texas, huh, huh Tamara? Because I heard football's big there. Yeah, the wind here is just awful. I mean, it wouldn't be cold if it wouldn't been for the wind being so terrible. I've been freezing since last night. I don't know, probably coming down with something again. Like and share the video okay now now the thing it trick is taking it off without taking the one center peg out hey it did pretty good this time are you ready for your craft show barb or you still got stuff to make i know it's coming up
cold is it out there, Barb? I know your guys are normally probably warmer than we are. I know Susan's warmer than we are. Oh, girl, you can come here and do mine next. Mine's available. I did do two loads of laundry yesterday and two loads of dishes from in the dishwasher. And Thad won't be home today, so I guess I can get some more things done. Yeah, Susan's house is spotless anyway, so she don't have to clean it too much. <clears throat> you could eat off Susan's floor, I tell you. She could just instead of putting you at the table, she could just she could just scoop the food out on the on the on the kitchen floor and make you eat, and it'd be okay. Yeah, there's my there there's the truck buffalo plaid one. Tails for days. Uh, let me see which one goes in what direction. And then I normally take the tails and roll them roll them up so they roll. That way they, they kind of curl down the tree. And it's nice to have them rolled up when you ship them. Uh, he's, he, cause he's in Kentucky. He had to go to Kentucky, so he won't be home. He's delivering go uh chicken in Kentucky this week. Yes, this is all Sam Club ribbon. All of it. Uh, every bit. I, I 
I don't know whether everybody's seen, but Thad found me some ribbon last week. He found me this, and he found me this last week at Costco's. But yeah, this is all Sam's Club. We looked everywhere to find this and the truck ribbon, and we finally found it in New York on our vacation. Yeah, Thad's in Kentucky. That's where he's at. He's hauling uh, chicken. Yeah, I think they turned out pretty cute. Even the one I did too small, I think it'll work perfect on my on my little tree. Because I'm gonna have, I'll have. Uh, some picks coming out the top to make it even more. And this is the one one I made. The bigger one I made. Uh well, ever his backhaul changed this week. Every week they're different, so it mean it means some weeks he gets to come home on Thursday. Some weeks he doesn't, so you just never know about his schedule. Either that or he might be coming to visit you, Susan. I'm not sure. Maybe I need to be checking. He may say he's going to Kentucky and he's, he's actually go, coming to visit you. Who knows? Maybe I need to check. Yeah, I thought when I when he brought this one home, I thought that reminded me of a baby wreath. I don't know why. Oh, girl, we all know Thad. Thad loves to do laundry, and he's even ran the sweeper at the neighbor's house. So you never know about him. Thad gets a free pass, but yeah, he found that. And they had some other cute ribbon. I told him, I said, I need to kick him because he didn't pick it up. But maybe I'll get to go back there. I have to find a Christmas tree this week. Um, if anybody's in the hunt for a Christmas tree, Hobby Lobby has them 50% off, and I think Michael's has them 60% off, so I've been looking at trees there. But... Uh, that's all that's what that's what's going on I'm getting ready to move getting things ready so I can move and uh, and I've been just doing videos now now and then and uh, that's about it I right, we've been selling some stuff because we're getting ready to move Which you don't know how much you've collected in six years until until you start doing that. <laughs> yeah, but oh, oh, Con, you know it's a lot of fun to tease Susan. Teasing Susan's right up there with the top thing I like to do. We're not sure where we're moving yet, but uh, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to move. Susan says I'm moving next door to her because she 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 says she she diap she she diapers and and, and uh, bottle feeds you. But uh, yeah, we don't know yet when we when we get the logistics of where we're going and the plans made. 
we'll let everybody on the page know where we'll be. But right now we're just in the we got to get down size so we could move stage. So this uh, this Thursday, next Thursday, hold on to your hat. I'm going to have a live sale and sell some more stuff. So uh, get ready because next Thursday we're going to have a live sale. Yeah. I know where we're playing and where we're looking, but it's not in Oklahoma. Well, all I'm going to say is it is where is I want to move somewhere it's warmer than here. So that's that's the only thing I'm planning is something warmer. But have a good day. I may I don't know whether I'll be back or whether I'll just tape another video for YouTube. But I have another project I'm going to be doing sometime today. Hey, Melissa. Oh, wow. That sounds wonderful. <laughs> yeah, I think all the designers are in Texas, aren't they? But, uh, yeah, have a good day. Keep on crafting. Love y'all. Bye. Susan, call me. Bye.